U.S. facing military recruitment crisis. The U.S. Army, Navy and Air Force are facing shortfalls in recruitment targets this year as the Pentagon struggles to compete with civilian employment, while up to 77% of young people have been deemed ineligible to enlist, the New York Times said. By the end of its recruitment year on September the 30th, the U.S. Army fell short of its target of adding 65,000 people to its ranks, the publication says, instead ending up with about 50,000 new personnel. It is the third successive year that the Army has not met its goal, prompting military bosses to cut unfilled positions and shrink its active duty membership to 452,000 from 485,000 in 2021. The recruitment logjam has created an existential issue for us. Army Secretary Christine Warmoth told that even as some branches of the military relax recruitment standards and even offer financial compensation of up to $75,000 to join, a recent report by the U.S. Department of Defense concluded that up to 77% of young people in the United States cannot enlist for a variety of reasons, including being overweight, drug abuse, or having physical or mental impairments. The U.S. Navy also fell short by about 7,500 hires this year, despite recruitment initiatives, including financial incentives. Even the Air Force, traditionally considered an attractive destination for new recruits, added about 10% less than expected.